So over the last two days, we've spent time here at police headquarters, seeing children and, uh, and young adults from across the county, from 15 different schools, who have taken part in this year's County Schools Challenge. That challenge this year was directed at road safety, particularly to 12 to 16 year olds. Nationally and locally, we have an issue uh, around road safety, and part of our mission is to protect people from harm. Road safety is part of that. And this year, we've seen some really creative ideas, some innovative ideas around how we can engage our young people across the county to help reduce uh, road accidents on our local roads. It's been fantastic. Uh, I, I was really impressed with the quality of presentation, the creativity and innovation from our young people. Uh, so we've had ideas around apps for smartphones, uh, street art, all the way through to poster campaigns and social media campaigns. Really impressive from all of the individuals that took part. There'll be eight groups, uh, so eight schools, going through to the final, uh, which will be held uh, in the next few weeks, whereby they go and take on, on board our feedback, uh, from, from the semi-finals and they hopefully then go to the finals, have made changes and can deliver a really good pitch to the final Dragons who will award the prize which in this instance is £2,000 to progress their idea. So the finalists in no particular order, Southfield School, Brook Western Academy, Corby Technical School, Manor School Sports College, Chenderit School, Moulton School and Science College, Corby Business Academy and Eyesbrook College. Well done to all of the finalists and well done to everybody that took part. We were really impressed with all of the presentations throughout the two days.